This painting actually is a perfect example of what my process is. The model that you see in this painting is someone, a young man that I met in the streets of New York City. Most of the models that you'll see in my paintings are complete strangers. I'll come up to them and ask them if they have an interest in posing for me, which most people say no to. Turns out that uh, approaching complete strangers in urban areas puts people's guards up. And so I've evolved uh, a practice over time of showing examples of my work, trying to convince people of the merit, the history. Uh, I invited him back to my studio, and he went through our history books. And what we uh, happened upon was this portrait of a nobleman named uh, William von Hyacinth. What I'm doing in this painting is playing positively with the history of art, but also positing the image of what it feels like and looks like to be in America during this particular time period. It's about this sort of jump in temporal space between the original object and who and where we are today. The body language is one of absolute authority and defiance. But I think it also looks quite different when transposed onto a body in the 21st century. These young black men now occupying this space once the exclusive terrain of the powerful and the rich. That shift between who gets to be in these pictures and why I think is the real meat of this project. Oftentimes when you look at a painting like this, you'll also consider scale. The size of these paintings matters as much as anything else. What I want to do for the viewer is to have an experience in which they're being possessed as much as the painting possesses the sitter. The camera, when I'm shooting the model, is always just a bit lower than eyes view, so that when you're looking at the painting, you get that sense of, of awe that was originally intended for these paintings. What I'm doing is I'm playing with the language of power, the language of power that has existed in Western easel painting for hundreds of years. And I'm trying to use certain aspects of that to my own purposes.